All right, first things first is uh, when you come up with an idea, uh, Photoshop right here, CS4, um, the Creative Suite 5 um, will be out kind of soon. I understand that they're going to be only releasing 64-bit versions for some of the software, um, such as After Effects, maybe a couple others. So beware all you 32-bit people. Okay, so... What I did is I went into Illustrator earlier and I created a couple of files, one of which I exported as a JPEG. Normally I would do character mockups in uh, Photoshop here with my handy tablet, but this one I just wanted to do quick. What you see here is the KiwiBot basic breakdown design. Um, the joints, uh, side shot, forward shot, both are in proportion to one another. If I hit Control R on my keyboard, I can bring up rulers. And I see that these are at the same height. Uh, the nose, everything, so I don't have to bother chopping all these things up and, you know, making them the same scale. I just did that earlier in, in uh, uh, Illustrator. So what I would do here is I hit Control Alt I, and uh, if you've watched my tutorials before, you know that I have two screens, so things sometimes pop up on my right screen. I look at the dimensions: eight eighty two five five four, and I know that that's what I want to set for my. Uh, my plane in Studio Max. Or if you just wanted to cut them now. Grace, so this has a black border. Maybe I want to hit C on the keyboard for your crop tool. And also, if you watch my tutorials before, you know that Camtasia for some reason really like bogs my computer down. So hit enter with that, or you could just double click inside the box. Alright, so we didn't really have to set up our panels that we would have had to chop it up had we had not these things to scale. So I'm not going to do anything with this. I'm just going to leave it. I'm going to close this. I just brought this step up to show you what I would do if I was creating an all-new character, which you guys are going to be doing this time. So I'm going to close that, and I'm going to open Studio Max 2010. 2011 is on the brink of being released. I'm very excited about that. Uh, that has an all-new material UI. It's going to be based on node um, placement. Uh, if you don't know what that means, I don't really know how to help you. But it's very exciting for me. It's a, it's, a, it's a big, big jump from the old school slot. I don't know what that's called, actually. Oops. Sorry, I get this a lot. I don't have uh, all my stuff in order with Studio Max. I just have enough in that I can do what I like to do when I like to do it. And again, it's taking a while to boot up because uh, Camtasia is bogging me down, as usual. Makes my screen flicker, does a whole bunch of bad stuff. Alright, there we go. Maybe we'll get another pop-up here for the fume. There you are. Okay. 